First topic of the day, Miami, Florida. The Hurricanes, their best offensive lineman on the team, the most experienced, the one that was expected to to kind of help their offensive line problems uh, get better this year. He was going to be the leader of that unit. He is He's played more snaps than anybody else on the team, I think. Yes, he most certainly has. His name is Navon Donaldson. Yep. And he has decided to redshirt this upcoming season. And I don't think he's going to be the last. He nope. uh, he tweeted, after talking to family and the coaching staff, I decided to redshirt and focus on me this season. Uh, it says, it should be noted that Donaldson's 2019 season came to a premature end when he suffered a serious knee injury in the regular season finale against Duke. It is unclear if that played a role in his decision to sideline himself for the upcoming season. He has not previously used his redshirt. So he came in in the class of 2017. He has played more than anybody else. I mean, he's a stud. And they don't have a lot of studs on that offensive line in Miami. I think you are going to see a ton of kids decide that they want to redshirt this upcoming season. Just because of the differences that you're going to see in the in the stadiums, in the way that the games are going to be played, whether they're not wanting to deal with the coronavirus, whatever it is, I think that you're going to see a lot of kids sitting out this year. You feel the same way? Yeah, and and I'm going to tell you this. If you're not a guaranteed, like, NFL draftee, or you definitely know that, it, you know, you're going to have to develop before you can get there kind of thing, um, then, then burn it this year because this year is going to be a weird, wacky year anyway. And – this could be a good thing for teams looking for depth and really playing for 2021 of let's play some of our younger guys to get them a little experience. And then next year we red shirt them. So like if you've got a young offensive lineman, you would normally red shirt this year. Well, let's, let's play him this year, red shirt the stud. And then our young guy can sit out his sophomore year and then we've got an extra year on the back end where he's older, more experienced, but at a young age, he kind of at least gets a season, whatever the season looks like. He gets reps under his belt of, okay, I got to get better at this, this, and this. And then he has an entire off season to get better at those things. Yeah, there's a ton of ways that you can go about this. It's a little strange because they brought in De'Eric King thinking they were going to have a chance to do something yeah. kind of special this year. Obviously, they had issues last year with their their quarterback play. But I don't blame this kid at all. Uh, no, Donaldson, no, I mean, I don't, and I'm with you. He won't. He shouldn't be the last. He just shouldn't. This is going to be a jacked up weird year. If you're not just dead set, even if you are, if you're if you're Trevor Lawrence, there's a, there's a world in which you sit out this year and just get ready for the NFL. Yep. Because this is going to be a weird year. Now, you uh, you have got that 